They were searching him. What were they looking for? Torn flower petals. Dirt. Like he was digging for something. Or trying to hide it. Marked by shallow cuts. They were torturing him. Whatever they wanted, he wouldn't give it up. He gave his life for whatever he was hiding. I should see if I can find it. Same flowers I found in the monk. This must be what the monk hid from the Mongols. It belongs at Kushi Temple. I came to return something that was stolen. I never thought I'd see this again. One of your monks lost his life to protect it. That man was no monk. He was a peasant we'd taken in. One morning I woke to find him gone, along with this statue and one of my robes. Then he wasn't a martyr. He was a thief. We are all subject to our choices. His ended in suffering.
çıksa! Finally, I was getting tired of waiting for you. This is madness. You're not a warrior, just a murdering dog. That's the spirit. Come on, Sakai. I've been looking forward to this. I'm here now. Kill again. Oh! 
My poor boy, why did it have to be you? <laughs> what happened here? The Mongols found out my sons burned one of their supply wagons. They forced me to choose which son they'd kill as punishment. Oh, I'm sorry. What happened to your other son? They took him. I'm sure it was Chuta's idea to burn their supplies. He may still be alive. Which way did they go? Across the bridge. Jump, Hara, 
father told me about his choice to save you. Saved me? The Mongols asked him who to spare. My brother's name left his lips without a thought. When he saw they meant to keep Genta instead, he begged them to take me. I can't face him. This all happened because I asked Genta to help burn that wagon. What do you want me to tell your father? That you were too late to save me. Father's not here. Maybe he left a
was too much. He drowned himself, but it was the Mongols who pushed him to it. <laughs> 